Namo Buddhaya, this is Avinav Gulecha and I welcome you. In this video, I want to talk about how to practice mindfulness uh, in sense activities. In the activity of seeing, hearing, tasting, smelling and touching. Right? These are the five sense bases. So how basically we should practice the mindfulness. See, first of all, understand mindfulness. The aim of mindfulness is liberation. Right? Liberation from the cycle of suffering. What Buddha said in the Satipatthana Sutra, the four foundations of mindfulness. Right? So this is the direct way of liberation that Buddha has given. So uh, you can check out my detailed video on the, uh, uh, the Satipatthana Sutra, the discourse on the four foundations of mindfulness. So now my learning is based on the insight meditation practice as given by Mahasi Sadao, which is based on the Satipatthana Sutra, on how to practice the mindfulness in the right way so that we can get insight. Insight into what? Insight into impermanence and non-self, right? See, the underlying idea is that our view is wrong. When we see things, we, say, we think that we are under the view that, you know, I have a permanent self and I am seeing, which is the wrong view, which basically keeps us bound in this cycle of existence. The right view is in, is in seeing that when we see something or hear something, there are three things that are involved. One is the object. For example, it may be the uh, person whom we are watching or it may be some sound that we are hearing or some, the, some uh, smell, the object where, which we are smelling. right? So these are the object. Second is the, the sense object, the sense base. It may be eye, it may be nose, it may be ear, it may be skin, it may be the tongue. And the third is the consciousness that arises while we are seeing or hearing. So, for example, there is an object that is outside. There, ha there arises a corresponding, corresponding consciousness in us that allows us to see or hear. So, at any time, there are so many processes. For example, then there is a computer that is running. If you press Ctrl or Delete, then you can see so many processes that are running in the computer. So, the wrong view to say is to know that only that there is a computer and I am working on a computer. The right view is an understanding that there are so many processes that go into a particular task. So, similar way, when we see or hear, there are, you know, a lot of things that arises in me. And they arise by themselves. Right? The object arises, the consciousness arises, the sense base is there. Right? They all come in play. So, what the problem happens is that if I think only I am seeing and I am like not mindful, then the latent seeds of defilement in me, for example, lust arises. For example, if I see an attractive woman and the lust arises in me and the lust arises in me and that lust can make me do certain actions which can cause karma, which causes the you know, unwholesome actions, which can make me do unwholesome actions and which, one, which can cause the karma, you know, the karma to rise and that karma keeps me in this cycle of samsara. So the essential thing what we have to do is that every time what Mahasi says is the link to the detailed ebook uh, uh, of the Mahasi's instructions, it's a free ebook. The link is there given below. The audiobook of the entire Mahasi's book is also given below. You can read that. So what Mahasi says is that every time the you know object arises, you can just note the consciousness as seeing seeing or hearing hearing or smelling smelling. Right? Just note it. Don't verbalize. No need to verbalize. Even when you are doing sitting meditation and you, you know, some sound comes, you can just visualize, not sorry, not visualize, just note it. Sound, sound or hearing, hearing. Just note it. Now, the, what it does is that the sound arises and you have just noted it when it arises. So, you don't allow the latent defilements to arise in you. You note the thing there and then that it arises. So, number one, you do not arise, allow the latent defilements to arise. You do not create any further karma. Second thing what you are doing is that you, by this regular practice, you develop this idea, you extinguish this idea of a permanent self and you realize the impermanent nature of things and you realize the non-self. And this insight will free you and me. 
and achieve liberation make us enlightened free of suffering right so this is the right way so every time for example seeing seeing just note it seeing seeing or the object just focus on the object person person or the eye base eye eye or or ear ear or nose nose just concent just focus be aware of this place this nose or this ear whatever is the clearly distinct one thing so you do not need to like be aware of th all the three things no whatever is the clearly distinct thing that arises in this moment just be aware for example something like hearing hearing i just be aware then some painful sensation starts here then i just be aware of that sensation 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 or pain pain i am just be aware of that then in the next moment something else arises so this is insight meditation this is vipassana meditation right so one is the in the, in the sitting meditation all these things can arise so you can practice uh, these sense activities the mindfulness of these sense activities and during the day also try as much as possible that when these sense activities arise instead of just being lost in them practice you know any one thing that arises the element you know the reality that arises this is the reality you know this idea of a person is the wrong self you know when you see a woman in front of you that woman that you see you are not seeing the woman you are basically under a illusion right reality is there is this woman right now being mindful that there is this woman being mindful that there is an i that sees that woman and the the consciousness that sees that woman right so any one of that you have to just focus on as much as possible do that i hope this i've tried to simplify uh, the mindfulness of sense activities through this video if there is any question that you have you can post it in the comment section any feedback any thoughts any reflections do post it in the comment section do check out the detailed satipatthana vipassana ebook uh, by mahasi sadao uh, in the description the link is there in the description thank you so much for watching this video namo buddhaya namo buddhaya